Former Democratic U.S. Congresswoman Tulsi Gabbard stunned a far-right Fox News host Friday night, falsely claiming President Joe Biden has chosen his cabinet members based solely on factors of genetics and race, while comparing Biden to Hitler. In a segment attacking President Biden's cabinet, as the Daily Beast reported, Gabbard, a Fox News contributor, suggested he was proud to be hiring people, selecting people, based on genetics, race, based on your blood, your genes. And where do we see that connection? Well, these are the very same geneticist core principles embodied by Nazism and Adolf Hitler. President Biden put together one of the most qualified cabinets in history. He also promised his cabinet, unlike his predecessors, would be as diverse as America itself. President Biden's proposed cabinet would be the most diverse in U.S. history, the New York Times reported one day after his inauguration, comprising more women and people of color than any cabinet before it, which, in many ways, fulfills Mr. Biden's campaign promise to select a team that looks like America and modernizes the predominantly male, white institution. Building a diverse team will lead to better outcomes and more effective solutions to address the urgent crises facing our nation, he said in a speech in December when announcing some of his cabinet nominees. The Times also pointed to some notable firsts in Biden's cabinet. In addition to the barrier-breaking Vice President Kamala Harris, there will be America's first female Treasury Secretary, Janet Yellen, its first openly gay secretary, Pete Buttigieg for the Department of Transportation, its first Native American secretary, Deb Holland, for the Department of the Interior, the first woman to serve as Director of National Intelligence, Avril Haines, and the first immigrant to lead the Department of Homeland Security, Alejandro Mayorkas, to name just a few. Gabbard shared with Fox News host Jesse Waters her theory that what we're seeing here is, Democrats, philosophy, identity politics. And this is one of the main reasons why I left the Democratic Party, because you seeing how their agenda of identity politics is directly undermining the traditional democratic values that were expressed so beautifully and clearly by Dr. Martin Luther King, that we should judge each other not based on the color of our skin, but based on our character. It's demonstrably false to claim President Biden considered only diversity factors to build his cabinet which is comprised of people with tremendous experience and accomplishments. A look at their extensive biographies exposes Gabbard's claim as false.